Hello recommenders, here is Romeo from recommendationbook.com and today I have the review of another Gunzo knife, the Gunzo G732. Now uh, the box is the normal Gunzo box, it's the old, old Gunzo box, came with the silica gel, the bubble wrap and the silk sack, the new silk sack, uh, no, nothing special about the box. Now let me show you the knife. Here's here is the Gunzo G7732. As you can see, it's the it's a copy of the Endura from Spider. Now why do I want that you get this knife? I want a knife with the spider hole. I want you to try the the spider hole from Gunzo. And uh, now the specifications. She's here is the model G732, the liner, the liner lock, lock, lock type is liner lock. The steel is 440C with satin finish. The handle material is two liners with G dent. The blade hardness is not informed by guns. The weight is 4.1 ounces. The overall length is 8.4 inches. The blade length is 3.7 inches. Check it out in the description box. I'm gonna leave it on the description box all the other measurements I did for this knife. Now let me give you a size comparison with a pen. She's here is, a, is the Gunzo G732 in comparison with the Likes B2 pen. Now the Gunzo G732 in comparison with the Cold Steel Recon. The Cold Steel Recon is a 4 inches blade. 4 inch blade. And here in comparison with the Pro Light. The Pro Light is a 3.4 inches blade. The G732 is a 3.7 inch folder. Now the initial sharpness, let's see the initial sharpness. I already cut some oranges, apples, in a, a layer of cardboard. So this sharpness here is after cutting uh, three apples, no, three oranges, one apple, and some pieces of cardboard. Let's see the cheap sharpness. So initial sharpness is very good. Cheap sharpness is very good. Uh, the corrosion resistance of the 440C from guns is going to be very good. Easy sharpen is very good. Blade center, let's check the blade center. Just a little to the right. Blade play, let's check for blade play. No blade play side to side. No blade play upside down. No blade play. The quality of the hardware from guns is very good. The ergonomics of the handle. It's very good, very comfortable. The clip doesn't does not make a hot spot. Ergonomic is very good. There is a linear hole here. Very big linear hole. There is space in the handle for the four fingers. If you have big hands, this knife is gonna be good for you. If you have very large hands, this here is going to be a very good knife for you. Cleaning inside the handle is very good. As you can see, there is holes to save weight. Uh, the deployment, the opening method is the spider hole. Very easy to open. Let's see if I can flick the knife again. 
it flicks with some wrist movement. You can flick the knife with some wrist movement. Uh, the orientations is very good. There is a uh, right side chip up, chip down, left side chip up, chip down. Let's see how much is going to appear when the knife is on the pocket. Here's, here's what's going to appear when the knife is in the pocket. Very discreet. From 0 to 10 I give a 6 from how discreet the clip is. Very discreet clip. It's easy to put in and out of the pocket. Very easy to put in and out of the pocket. Uh, Utilitarian application is a great slicer. The clip is great. It's smooth. It's lightweight. It's affordable. The only downside is that the chip is not very strong. The chip is not very strong. So if you want a folder with a strong chip, look elsewhere. But if you want a folder that is going to pierce like a hot knife in butter, just the right knife for you. The tactical application. It's very fast, it has a good reach, it's very grip, lockup won't be so good as a cold steel with a triad lock, oops, lockup won't be so good as a cold steel with a triad lock, so it's better if you don't allow nothing to hit the spine during, of the blade during the fight. Now the final considerations. Uh, the price I pay was $16.76, but this knife here is on sale today for $12.49. I'm gonna leave the link for you to buy in the description box. Link to buy in the description box. Now the conclusion. This knife here may be the best slicer from all guns. It is recommended. It is highly recommended. Highly recommended. It's a great slicer. Well, for this the review for the Gunzo G732, check it out the, the description box for the measurements and the link to buy this knife. It's on, it's on sale today on Gearbest. Leave your comment in the comment section. Thanks for watching and see you later.